Hi there, Chris from Stone Age Gamer here. Now, chances are, if you own an Atari Jaguar, you've taken a look at your shelf recently and thought, these games are getting very expensive. Maybe I shouldn't be taking them on and off this shelf quite as often as I do. Wouldn't it be great if there was something out there that would allow you to play your entire Jaguar catalog, homebrews included, on a single cartridge? Well, there is! It's this. This is the Jaguar Game Drive from Retro HQ. It's available at Stone Age Gamer. Let's take a look. Okay, let's take a closer look at the Jaguar Game Drive from Retro HQ. What you're looking at here is the Deluxe Edition case that we offer at our site. It's one of our bit boxes that's been modified to fit the Jaguar Game Drive. Uh, and let's take a look uh, on the outside here. You got your logo, you've got the, uh, looks real nice on your shelf. It's got some basic information across the back. Uh, and we crack this open on the inside, we've got the cartridge itself, which uh, looks real nice here. It comes with this uh, little foam bit here on the bottom to keep everything from sliding around over here on the side. You've got some basic information. You've got Stone Age Gamer uh, websites and stuff for troubleshooting flashcards, some basic info there. You've got Retro HQ's official instruction manual, complete with QR codes to help you get sussed out if anything's going wrong and you can't figure out what to do with your system. And then you got a couple of stickers because uh, we like uh, putting stickers on things. Stickers are great. So let's take a closer look at the uh, cartridge itself. This is the Jaguar game drive. Now, in case you're unfamiliar with the, uh, the concept, this is a flash cart. Uh, and what it does is it allows you to play your uh, legally obtained personal backups of your games on a single cartridge. So you don't have to keep taking your collection off the, on and off the wall and, and taking your cartridges inside in and out of their boxes, which are their flimsy cardboard boxes. You know, uh, it's it's a convenience thing and it's really, uh, it's really quite nice. It handles it with ease and it also works for homebrews. The vast majority of homebrew games for the Atari Jaguar uh, can be played on a game drive. So you can load them into this thing as long as you legally own them, uh, load them up, and then you can play your Jaguar homebrews on original hardware, which is extraordinarily cool. And you do that by loading your stuff onto a micro SD card. Uh, your your games, your, uh, get, uh, your game files get loaded onto the micro SD card and they go uh, right into the top here. And uh, that is pretty much it. Once the SD card is in there, uh, this will just run those games as if they were an original cartridge inside your system. Uh, and it'll run it, no emulation necessary, just runs the games, which is pretty awesome. Uh, you can see that it is shaped a little bit differently from your standard Jaguar cart. Here's my Bubsy cart, which looks like it was chewed on by a Bobcat. That's interesting. Uh, and you can see that it's uh, it's the same size down the bottom, so it, does, it fits in your system exactly as an old uh, Jaguar cart would. It's just a bit less ornate because, well, who really needs all this wacky stuff? Uh, the curvature on the back of these things was completely unnecessary. Who knew? Uh, so yeah, that's that's a comparison right between these two. Now we looked at the uh, deluxe edition cart, uh, deluxe edition case earlier, but you also have the option to pick up one of these. This is the um, a clip case from Retro Frog. This is a 3D printed case. Uh, it has the the logo uh, printed right there on it. Uh, in it actually, I believe the filament is actually red in these in these areas. I can't say I know enough about 3D printing to really explain the science of it, but that's like. That's not painted on, that's that's the color of this thing. Uh, so this is a real nice snug fit. All you gotta do is make sure you have the uh, the sharp corners here and the rounded corners at the top because this thing is fit perfectly in there. And there you go, nice little clip case. It's a hard case uh, and it'll keep this thing nice and protected. If you're looking for something a bit smaller and a little bit less ornate to go on your shelves or to keep your game drive in, keep it safe, this is a fantastic option. So I guess the only question now is to see this thing in action, huh? So uh, why don't we go take a look? Okay, so here we have the uh, the main menu up here. I've got my Jaguar controller. The system's running right down there with the red light on it. And uh, so this is the uh, the file as uh, I just dropped, literally dropped the folder into the uh, SD card, did no other formatting, but there's other formatting things you can do to customize things like pictures and stuff like that. Uh, but we're just gonna keep things pretty simple here. I'm gonna go ahead and choose uh, Switchblade. Let's choose Switchblade. This is a newer, I'm not sure what split Switchblade is, uh, it, cause it's licensed by Pico Interactive. So it's one of the free games that you get with the uh, the game drive when you buy it at Stone Age Gamer. Uh, you can see it just loads up the ROM. Then we go right to the Jaguar uh, startup screen. And there's the Jaguar Cube. All right, so here we are. Uh, we are playing Switchblade, and uh, 
I'm gonna go ahead and move my character around. You can see it just works exactly like it would if you were uh, playing it on a cartridge. Uh, Ta-da! Get that guy. This is such a strange game. You get, you know, it's, it's an up to jump kind of a thing, and your different moves are done by like holding down the attack button. So your regular ones is this punch. So I suppose I can hit this guy from here, but then these other guys, I gotta like charge it up so I can do the little down. Oh, I missed. Oh, my timing's off. There we go. Got him. Uh, there you go. That's uh, that is this thing working. That's kind of the, the the basics of it. You just plug it in. You play Jaguar games. That's really all there is to it. And that is it. That's the Jaguar game drive in action. The Jaguar game drive from Retro HQ is available now at StoneAgeGamer.com, so you can play your entire Jaguar catalog, most homebrews included, on original hardware with this single cartridge. It's pretty neat. Thanks for watching, everybody. If you like what you saw here today, please follow, comment, like, subscribe, share, and let us know down in the comments which Jaguar games are you going to play first, and why are they Flip Out and Bubsy? Because what defines that system more than Flip Out and Bubsy? I'm just kidding. There's tons of great Jaguar games, and Flip Out's one of them. Don't pass on that game. It's genuinely fun. Thanks again, everybody. On behalf of all of us here at Stone Age Gamer, keep playing games.